Getting organised can be done in a number of different ways. Using a diary seems to be a really good idea, but you've got to remember to write in the diary, so that can be quite difficult. But lots of young kids will now have their own mobile phone. This can really be incredibly useful. And if they've got a laptop as well, what you can do is sync the laptop to their mobile phone. So if they can put in entries for homework, they can put it in the mobile phone, and then it syncs with their laptop when they're at home or they're at school. That can make a very big difference. Using something like Microsoft Outlook, which is usually on, or, uh, on every computer, or Apple Entourage if they're using Apple Macs. So that can sync. Most mobile phones now will do that. Nokia and, and most of the others will do that as well. If your child is um, needing to set down ideas, then you might want to use something like a to-do list. So you could create your own, and the child can start off when you're working with them to write the key areas. But for some children, it's quite difficult to prioritise. So you might need to help them. What do you need to do first? What do you need to do second? And you can do this with quite young children, starting with, you've got three things to do today. Let's write down the three. And as you've done them, tick them off. You might want to create something like a visual planner with your child. And so you can see what they've got to do. And as they've done them, you take it off. Or create something like this, which is things to do. And they take off the different icons. And they could make that with you at home. Laminator is brilliant for this sort of thing. But you could make a paper-based one if you want to do with some card. But having a visual reminder of what you've got to do will help your child feel secure knowing what they've got to do next. Often that anxiety of not really knowing what they've got to do and how long it's going to take can be the reason why they don't sit down and start doing the work in the first place.